Good morning. As I was going through my Google Documents, like Google Docs is like where, where I keep all my like documents for either work or YouTube or anything else. I realized that actually I've got loads of like random documents that don't have a title or maybe they do and it's just titled like s short story and then I'll read through it and it'll be like an account of something that I've done, something I've gone through or an experience that I had but I write it in the, in the kind of perspective of someone else. It's still kind of my perspective but I'm learning how to, you know, think differently, think as another human being, because ultimately, if I were to write a story, it would sound different to someone else writing a story, someone who is a creative writer. Maybe they genuinely do think with such beautiful ways of describing the scenery and the action and whatever. And so this all got me thinking, like, there must be like a huge benefits to just writing like little short stories, even if it is only like a, a page long or a paragraph even, as long as you occasionally and hopefully frequently tap into that kind of creative side of you which we all have i don't care if you're like some numbers guy who doesn't have the the brain for creativity it doesn't matter because it's all <coughs> jesus it's all percentages you know it could be 99 percent logical one percent creative that's still one percent and if you practice that it'll probably grow and it'll, you know, we all have like the, I forgot which side of the brain it is. I'm pretty sure it's the right side of the brain. The left side is logical. I don't know what I'm saying, but we all have like the ability to be creative. Oh, look at my cat over there. Meow. And so as someone being maybe not 50, 50, but more of a creative person, it just makes me happy that I'm, this old and yet I still kind of write those little that I still write these kind of you know fictional stories you know when I was younger I was really creative and I'd always write some random story and I'd, I'd draw pictures with it like that's just something you used to do as a kid and I feel like in the kind of teenage years I've, we all kind of lose that creative part of us which I think we should fight to keep because you know being childish not childish but still connecting with our inner child is much better than just neglecting it entirely and just going through life as a boring adult you know so do some creative writing honestly it's so fun like sometimes some nights i just i can't fall asleep because in my head i'm just like writing like an entire freaking story and then i try to write it in the morning and it's all gone so i think in those times even though I could affect my sleep, it would be better for me to just write it all down. Um, but that's very irrelevant. Go and write a short story. All right, I'll talk to you later, man. Check out the link in the description. I've created a course to become a sheet blaster. So this includes a full guide on how to beat depression and a full productivity guide and a mental mastery guide so yeah if you if you do decide to buy that then i can buy my cat some fish so check that out